Hey there, my Tyler Perry sisters fans. It's your girl, Barbie J here. And I have this video here. And now I want to show you if they don't block it for copyright infringement or something. It's about the sisters, Sabrina, Andy, Karen, Danny, and also Fatima. Now this video that I want to share here is from TV Line. You know, and it's with the sisters verbally sharing their thoughts and feelings about their relationship with each other on and off the set and how they are, you know, a tight knit family and how their chemistry has just gelled together without even having a chemistry read of the script. They saying how, you know, Tyler Perry nailed it by putting them all together so it's, it's a great little video, you know, just seeing them. So, you know, their human side, I guess, outside of their <laughs> acting. So check out this video I've attached and let me know your thoughts about it down in the comment section below. Check this out. We're sisters through and through our first show to a pandemic we've been through a lot together the chemistry that you see on camera is real the only thing that's unreal is the relationship of fatima to the sisters in real life we're all a family in real life fatima loves everybody she's actually friends with everyone all the girls are so sweet so i always make sure that i let everybody know that we love everyone and that we are a big family i mean we genuinely care about each other as human beings just before we shot this kj stayed after a long shoot just to make sure I didn't have any flyaways. Everyone doesn't get this, and I know that, so I try to soak it in and not take it for granted. We did not have a chemistry reading. We were all hired separately, and then we came together, and we just gelled. We have to trust each other. Our show moves so fast. What we've learned is not to force anything in our group, and that's when we flow effortlessly. It's funny, because we talk often about how we're similar to our characters and how we're different. Off screen, we are just as versatile as the women that we play. You know, we have different life experiences, come from different parts of the country, are all different ages, and we're very aware of the space that we're in as women. We're coming into our own as the show is going on. We are growing in our own lives, too, and we're bringing some of that to the table. We don't get to see many stories about melanated women in their dating life. We don't get to see those intimate bonding relationships. They're extremely honest with each other. You could say anything you want to about these ladies, but the honesty and the transparency and the vulnerability is unmatched. I can look at all the girls on this show and say I identify with each one of them in some type of way. And I feel like Tyler really nailed it um, by writing these stories because so many women go through a lot of these things every single day. Their lives are so crazy and wacky. Like, it's, you, you almost wonder, like, does this really happen for people? But you can see the humanity in it. You can see uh, the human conditions. We force people to look at themselves and <laughs> figure out where they are on their journey and where they want to be. The idea of friendship and the idea of romantic love is something that everybody, regardless of gender or race, has to come up against in life. And I think that people resonate with the show because we're in the middle of figuring it out. Like, none of us have the answers. So being very human and very vulnerable and very imperfect. You get to see five different black women from all walks of life, all a part of this journey of finding themselves, finding love. And I think that really resonates with people because we're all on this journey of life together. So we are interacting with each other. We try to tell stories that people can relate to. Now, wasn't that a great video? And I must admit or, or just say that these ladies, they look so lovely in their beautiful pastel gowns. All of those pastel colors are giving me calm and relaxing feel. You know, all of these scenes, or should I say shots of them in this video, they show us like a softer side of their character, even, you know, and their personality. Let's put it that way. So to Sabrina, a.k.a. Novi, Andy, a.k.a. KJ, Karen, a.k.a. Ebony, Danny, a.k.a. Mignon, and Fatima, a.k.a. Crystal, thank you. Thank you for sharing your talents with me 
and the rest of your Tyler Perry sisters fans. We love you guys. We adore you. And we hope to have a better season six than we did with season five. <laughs> and that's, I'm leaving this message in case y'all look at it. I, I got to say something though. I got to say that, you know, I enjoy hearing Ebony, well, Karen talking in her regular voice and not that Karen character voice. I always thought that was her real voice, but now hearing her talk, I'm realizing it's not her voice. I guess it's for that character. Anyways, let me know how you, you know, felt about this three minute clip and how you felt with what they said. Also, you know what? Please do not forget to subscribe to my channel, June BLC. Then select the notification bell, select all, and it'll let you know every time I upload a new video. Then like this video, basically hitting that thumbs up button, write a comment and share it as well. And I will see you guys all in the next video. It's your girl, Barbie J, saying peace.